sometimes certain things happen that can't really be explained with words. But even without any explanation, things can be crystal clear. I think the main ingredient, though, is to be in the right place at the right time. And that's exactly what happened for me when I was five years old. It was a day like today. Long shadows in an amber-colored sky. My dad drove the car and my mom and him were just talking about things I really didn't understand. But I could see clearly through the car window as we rounded the corner. I saw something strange and glowing. It had flashing lights on it and neon tubes. And the letters spelled out a big announcement. Now showing. Before I knew it, though, we were inside this strange place, which was bigger than anything I had ever seen, and I was still only in the lobby. <laughs> Mom went to the candy counter and bought me a Hershey bar, and Dad knelt down in front of me and adjusted my small blue tie and said I was going to have to be real quiet now because in a few minutes, I was going to see my first movie. I can tell you my big smile instantly went away because now I was sure I wasn't at the circus. <laughs> I sat between Mom and Dad and wondered why so many velvet chairs were in front of a giant white sheet. And I asked my mom, how many beds do you think that would cover? But you know, before she could answer me, the room turned pitch black. And then lightning flashed above my head. I grabbed my mother's arm, and then the big white sheet turned into an empty, wide street filled with fire escapes all around me. And the sounds of distant whistles and finger snapping echoed throughout the room. I looked up, and over my head, the lightning was still there, and I looked back and forth from the lightning to the street in front of me, and the light changed shapes and did a dance. And so did everybody on the big white sheet. That day changed my life. And I wanted to know more than anything else in the world just what made that light dance. When it was all over and the street was just a big white sheet again, I turned and said to my father the only thing I was ever really sure about. I looked right into his eyes and I said, Dad, I'm going to do that.